Hello guys and welcome to today's video. Um, we're going to be looking at the new stem from Envy. This is something that I pointed out in a video I did on Mark Cavendish's new 2018 bike. This is was spotted by my uh, good friend Dan who I work with and finally we have some proper decent photos of it um, which is nice. So looking at here so it's more of a sleeker stem maybe a little bit more aero and um, maybe it looks like it could be pretty stiff as well with the tube shaping there. Um, so a little bit nicer, a little bit more modern, I think, compared to what um, Envy had on the last stem, for sure. So we'll start by having a look at the back of the stem here. So this stem's pretty um, pretty unique. It's a bit like the design of the um, Zip Service course they did for giant propels and canyons with the one and one quarter. So this can actually change stem degree angle. So there's three shims, I believe, that come with this by looking at sort of the notes from Envy themselves ranging from minus 7 to minus 17 degrees, so that's pretty cool, it'll cover pretty much everyone there, it means they, personally I guess for them, they don't have to make as many stems, they don't have to make different angle stems, I guess the problem with the original Envy um, was that it only came in its 1 degree, which was minus 6 I believe, so this comes with a minus 7 shim, a minus 12 shim and a minus 17, so it's going to suit racers, it's going to suit sportive riders, anyone really. Um, which is really cool that they've done that for, for this market. I guess one of the only real disappointing things by looking at the uh, stem here from them is that it doesn't seem to be internal DI2 ready, which is a huge shame, since they're making more of their sort of aero bars now, internal DI2 cable routing compatible, I believe. Um, but this stem isn't, so you've got to have your junction box still stuck out on the outside of the bike, which, if we were talking about three years ago, you'd be like, cool, that looks really cool, really neat, but... Now, in 2018, where everything's going more integrated, more internal, more clean cut, it's just, I don't think it's really good enough. We've got to speculate, to be honest, this stem's going to be retailing about £300. Going anything by the old stem could even be a little bit more than, than that. And we're looking at a stem here that's got external cable routing and no internal options, which is a massive shame, really, on that. What I am really glad of, though, is that they've gone a bit more integrated with the the Garmin mounts or Wahoo mounts, I'm guessing they're going to be doing both sort of types of mounts there, with a nice simple um, Allen key under there, which keeps it all nice and neat, keeps it all flowing on the stem, obviously um, people are like say, looking for that more integration side of things, so it's good to, to see that's there, and a couple of bolts underneath here obviously designed to to um, do it up there, there's also one on top, um, which I'll show you in the next photo, which um, obviously cleans out that front end, so it's a lot smoother for the airflow to go over. So here's from the top um, angle here, so you can see where that the junction box sort of makes it a little bit untidy on the top there, but it's very neat in the fact where it, it smooths over the stem and everything like that and moves through the through the top there and across, and they've got a nice top cap there to help smooth the air as well. Just makes the whole thing look very neat, and with that garment mount out front, I really am hoping that comes with it. Um, unlike the last one where you had to pay, I can't actually remember how much it was, but you had to pay... Um, extra to have that on there and it'll think it's quite a lot so I really hope that this time they've learned from that and put that with the stem so um, you have that with it and it's it's nice and a package when you're spending that sort of, sort of money on it there but thank you guys um, always for watching subscribing, commenting and everything it's a real big help especially this time with all the new uh, changes to the terms and condition for YouTube so um, if you enjoy the video, please share, comment, like, subscribe, and I will catch you guys later on for the next video. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.